the kit. So like in every video of mine, I have to apologise at the amount of animals in this room while I'm filming. No. No. We currently have two cats on the bed, one dog on my lap, and one needy dog right here. No! Why? 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 Stay. Stay. Thank you. Right, so, no! Oh, sweet Jesus. Can you just lie down and be quiet, maybe? All of you. This is just getting a bit ridiculous now. I'll just let... Technically, I haven't even started this video and I'm already defeated. So now I have about 25 minutes of raw footage of these guys being absolute idiots and I'm like, I'm supposed to leave here in about half an hour, so, um, so uh, things are going swell right now. Okay, let's, um, let's actually start this video. <laughs> oh god. It is the 13th of March, 2018. Holy macaroni. Is that saying? I got my first shot of testosterone on the 13th of October 2017, which means I have been on testosterone for five months on testosterone. That is absolutely mad. If you're new to my channel, hello, Jedediah Biggs, nice to meet you. Every month, um, I do a testosterone update. I will leave a playlist in the description to all of my testosterone updates in case you haven't seen them or you want to watch them again. That's cool. But for right now, this is my five month on testosterone update. What the actual f I have compiled a list of things that I have noticed this month um, in regards to changes or updates and, uh, and things of that nature. So um, let's just get started, shall we? First on my list is the wondrous acne. Since starting testosterone, my uh, acne has been pretty consistently shit. Um, but this month I've noticed that it's really started like aching and hurting. Um, so that sucks. <laughs> and it hurts and I just want to pop everything on my face, which isn't good for it. So um, I've been resisting that. Have you ever seen the movie Small Soldiers? I feel like I've got those tiny monsters under my skin and they're trying to get out and it hurts. Ow. <laughs> Next on the list might be wishful thinking but I'm gonna add it to this list anyway and that is the slightly intensified amount of peach fuzz I have on my face. I've noticed on like this region, um, the hair on my face has become slightly darker and more coarse. And in the right lighting, it might look like I've got the beginnings of like a preteen pedo stash. Um, don't know if that's something to be proud of, but I'm excited about it, so. <laughs> Next uh, is my temper. I uploaded a video a couple of weeks ago of a, uh, a failed attempt of filming a video. Um, it went a little something like this. Don't move the tripod, please. <laughs> Sorry. If you haven't seen that delightful video, I will link it below. I was just having an off day and I couldn't film and everything was going wrong. Kind of like today, except today I'm composing myself. That day, I didn't compose myself and uh, it, it all just came out and I was angry. <laughs> so yeah, my temper, it's, it's not been great, but I'm actually so impressed with how well I'm keeping it together. The amount of times I have wanted to call my mum a Uh, yeah, but I haven't. That's what counts, right? There have also been many times where I've wanted to punch the wall, but I've um, refrained from doing that because one, I would either break my finger because I'm not very strong, or two, I would in some miracle actually dent the wall and then have to pay for it. Um, and I don't have the money to do that, so. <laughs> now I understand why my brother was so angry going through puberty. Bro, I get ya. 
Next is my chest dysphoria. I have been quite the social butterfly this month and with being out in public and kind of aware of what you look like and how people are perceiving you, um, the dysphoria comes along with that a lot. I have been wearing my binder. I think I have said in a previous video that um, binders are great because they flatten your chest to um, their maximum capability, but they do make you super hyper aware that you do in fact have a large chest um, and that's that's not really fun. And it makes me feel kind of crap because I do have a very, very large chest that not even a binder can completely compress. So it makes me feel kind of unpassable sometimes, which sucks. There has actually been uh, more than one occasion where somebody has looked at me quite confused, kind of, I guess, trying to figure out my gender and then have actually looked down at my chest and proceeded to use female pronouns because of that. Oh, I feel like with situations like that though, you've kind of got to step back and think like, look, I am in such a good place with my transition. I have amazing friends and family who support me. I was able to start testosterone. And actually right now I am in the process of saving for top surgery and I might even possibly start fundraising. I haven't actually booked like a surgery date or anything like that, but yeah. Next is my sex drive. The past few months it's been pretty tame. Um, and then this month it kind of just smacked me right in the face. <laughs> I am just like constantly horny. I mean, if I was a biological male and I had a dick, I would have forever boners and probably get arrested. So that's, uh, that's been great fun. Oh, not in the way that you're thinking. Oh, sweet Jesus, did I just say that on the internet? Okay, let's just go on to the next one, I think. <laughs> God, my nan watches these. And of course, I like to end these videos on a voice comparison, um, which I can get a bit salty about because I haven't noticed that much of a difference in my voice. Um, although my friend Grady actually came up to me and said that he has, which was nice. So uh, cheers, Grady. I don't know if you were just being nice, but um, yeah. <laughs> okay, right. So uh, here's a clip of me one day on testosterone. Just thought a lot of stuff has happened since I uploaded that last video and I thought I, I better tell you and if I didn't tell you things would probably be a bit confusing for everyone. And uh, hi, I'm Jed and this is my voice five months on testosterone. So yeah, that is my five month on testosterone video. What the actual heck is my life. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know a lot of you really like these videos and find them very interesting. So, uh, cheers. And I also make these videos for my friends and family who I don't see like on the regular. Like I said before, I will leave a playlist of all my previous testosterone updates in the description. So you can check those out if you want. But for now, I am gonna go. I am very, very, very late now. Thanks to these motherfuckers. And uh, I will see you guys in the next video, which should be in a few days. So yeah. Bye guys. Hello there end screen people. So instead of you having to endure my voice for um, the end screen, I wanted to just show you what the sky looked like last night. It sounds a bit weird, but um, it just looked really, really cool. And me and my mum just sat outside and watched it um, because it looked pretty and cool and pink. So you can enjoy it now through the magic of the internet. Um, I actually sound like one of those 90s ads. Take a spin, now you're in with the techno set. You're going surfing on the internet. Yeah, anyway, enjoy the sky. Um, and, uh, okay, bye. <laughs> with being out in pump it is the... It is the tear part. You're so cute. I love how you just put up with my bullshit. Hi. Please don't scratch me. Thank you. I appreciate that. That is absolute mad. That's not distracting at all. I... Um, I... Yeah, like, oh, oh, Jesus.
Oh, that burp went up my nose. Oh. So yeah, like I said, acne has been pretty, hi, oh, my eye is itchy. So if you're new to my channel, hello, I am Jedi. Di da 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 da. I'm going to ask politely if you lie down, please. Okay. Lie down, please. Anything you can do, I can do better. Why have I got this song stuck in my head? And we have ended this video with two animals left. I don't know where the others have gone. That is literally going to be me as a dad. All right, I've made it home with two. Don't know what happened to the other five, but um, that's pretty good, right? <laughs> oh, sweet Jesus. <laughs> Oh! You have got to be pulling on my nut, Cookie. Just lie down, please. And then, oh, for the love of Lord. Oh wait, it's fine. I'm not late or anything. Oh, thank you. Oh, sweet Jesus. Why are you standing up? What are you gaining from that? All I can hear is you chewing on your nails. Oh, I feel like I'm listening to a cat chewing nails ASMR video. I don't like it. <laughs> You look so pissed. <laughs> you are a character, mate. Bye, everyone. Also, I want to insert an image of what I woke up to the other morning. I actually woke up to my cat spooning me. If that is not the loneliest sh you have ever heard. Jesus.